I'm Lex from Made You Look. I'm a makeup artist and body painter. I do creatures, characters, fun things on YouTube, but basically making yourself into something completely different from a human. I wasn't expecting you until 2.35. The very first video I ever made on YouTube, I literally was sitting on my bed, balancing lamps all over the place, putting skull makeup on from a Halloween store. And I'm like, you know what? Even if I'm not the most professional in the world, this is something that I love to do, and I'm gonna make a video on it. My very first video to actually get out there is called The Pumpkin King. It was a skull-based makeup based off of Jack Skellington from The Nightmare Before Christmas, which, you know, everybody loves, and I basically just made my own twist on it. My favorite video of all time is Old Lady Lex. Good evening! I don't think the camera was in focus. I can't see without my glasses. I don't own glasses, but if I did, I would need to see that. It's simple, but I love being an old woman. I don't know why, I have my whole life planned out. Like, I know when I'm 80, what I'm gonna look like. And I'm like, I'm making that into a video. I was probably an old woman for like, hours after filming that. <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel! The one that took me the longest on YouTube by far is my lizard tutorial because I did all the scales and everything without any stencils whatsoever. I wanted it to be completely freehand. I think that took me like five, six hours to do. The video where I think that I share the most about myself on YouTube is actually, I think, my second or third video on YouTube. It's called Creativity is Who I Am. So I go strolling into my first hour, and this one girl looks at me and she's like, you look like a freak. Everyone heard her. The whole class started laughing at me. It was absolutely terrible. I go through a bullying story based on a makeup that I actually wore to high school and had the worst day of my life. But that whole video is just based around the fact that you can get through bullying and be exactly who you are because creativity is who I am. I was diagnosed with type 1 diabetic when I was 13 years old. Now when I was first diagnosed, Definitely very rough going through a diagnosis. Your whole life changes. You really don't know much about it. Growing up, as I got older, I learned to make it as a part of who I am. It's not something that's gonna hold me back, and I want other people to know that as well. So when I started on social media, I created Made You Look For A Cure, which is a team under the American Diabetes Association. We've been raising money for about three or four years now, and we've raised over $60,000. If I could do makeup on any film, any kind of horror film, I would love to do like creatures and characters, scary stuff. Like I wanna give people nightmares. I mean, not like scar people, but you know, give them a good amount of nightmares. <laughs> I started loving scary things since the day I can remember, honestly. I love horror movies, I love horror everything. Actually, when I was in high school, I did this makeup and I painted myself completely, really pale white, built up my cheeks, had like blood coming from my eyes, terrified my poor mother, but that is a day I will never forget that I'm like, this, this is what I love. <laughs> if I could change bodies with anybody on YouTube, I have two answers. I would change with PewDiePie because I love video games, dude's amazing, and I would change with Hannah Hart because she loves food and I love food, so it would just be like, perfect. So, this is the background on my phone. This is Kane. He's my Akita. <laughs> the app that I could not live without, I'm not even lying right now, is YouTube. Reason is because I go on there and I read all my comments and I answer all of my comments on my phone, so I always have it in my hand all the time. <laughs> the last person I text is my grandma because she doesn't like to fly, so she can't be here with me in uh, California. We're from Chicago, but I'm always keeping my grandma updated like for everything. This is the last picture I took on my phone. I was at the Urban Decay headquarters, which is my favorite makeup company ever. This is basically me enjoying my entire life.
Thank you guys so much for watching ABC News. Be sure to subscribe to their channel and also head over to my channel, which is Made You Look. Thanks, guys.